I just want to say, like, saying that people are, uh, like, accusing Joe Biden of being a P3O is, like, one of the most disturbed things. And I think anybody that says that has stuff on their computer. Hello? Hey, what's good? Uh, what's going on? What's your, uh, what's your take? I wasn't planning on voting this year between Biden and Trump, whatever. So should I vote for Biden or should I vote for Trump? You should vote well, for Biden. Well, Colin, the chair, demands you vote for Joe Biden. Okay, and why is that? I'm because just... overall, better policies, better temperament, better understanding of geopolitical affairs and diplomacy, and how to get things done across the aisle. Okay. Uh, what, what about the border crisis? The, I, I don't know why nobody gets this. Immigrants help us. Yeah, Do you have yeah, any no, idea what... I completely understand that, but they're also right. stealing our job. They're not, They're not stealing our jobs. Kind of, in a way, yeah. No, not really. Okay. So but we have so so we have that. approximately twelve million immigrants in the country. Uh, don't know how many of those are are people that work in across the border and then go back. But um, so, from from my understanding, there's already one individual in Texas that murdered and. Uh, how should you say this? Uh, essayed somebody, and they came from a Mexico. Okay, mm -hmm. there's more. And you're Americans still twice as that. likely to commit those crimes if you're a U.S. citizen. I mean, Four times yeah. more likely if you're uh, committing property crime. This is a scare tactic. Scare tactic. Okay. And what it is? This is all the Republicans have: scare tactics, fear, and outrage. Can you watch? I'll prove it to you. Name me a single policy the Republicans have. Uh, like I said, I'm neutral, so it, yeah. See, it no, nobody knows. Well, they don't have any. Their their policies are: we're going to target local and state governments, we're going to take away rights, women's rights, LGBTQ rights, and we're going to defund everything so that everybody's like, you know, even though it's going to hurt our own voters. That's what I find mo craziest about it: is all these defunding shit's going to hurt their own voters. It's going to hurt everybody. I mean, yeah, I know. Right. They don't have any policies. But exclusively their voters. Um, yeah, more of their voters will be hurt by it. Hey, guys, if you are enjoying the show, make sure you hit the like, subscribe, and leave a comment down below. And if you want to support the channel, you guys can become a YouTube member on this channel or preferably join the Patreon in the link tree in the bio. Also in the link tree is my TikTok, Instagram, Twitch, and the OK Hi YouTube, which I post news to on a regular basis. Enjoy the rest of the show. The cutting When they cut federal dollars that go to these states, the federal dollars are the ones that build the infrastructure in these states. Doubt I'm 24, but yet I was born in 2000. Thank you. Sorry, I was okay. reading a comment. So, yeah, we have one guy that's trying to overthrow the United States government. Okay. And one guy that's not. I feel like that's a pretty simple... Uh, I guess that's fair. So, you're telling me I should vote for Biden for all the stuff he's done, right? Mm -hmm. I would say that there's a lot of stuff that he's done. But also... The rule of law and the Constitution. Preserving, the, uh, preserving our democracy. And uh, how, do, how do you feel about him touching little girls on uh, national news? Trump? I think it's interesting that none of them have come out and levied charges against him. Yeah, but Donald Trump has 30 essay allegations. But yeah, you know, we can look into that. That's fine. Yeah, we can absolutely look into that. I am absolutely opposed to what you're talking about, 100%. It does make me really suspect when people bring this up because it kind of makes me wonder what's on your computer. That's Awfully fair. quiet. I mean, both presidents done some questionable things i would not lie one of them has a verdict against them yeah joe biden does not have he has tara reed made sexual allegations against him and she is a proven liar her lawyer dropped her for lying she lied in court about being an expert witness on numerous different occasions her story doesn't really make any sense i'm not saying it shouldn't be looked into but when you take it face value with Donald Trump, he has 30 essay allegations. And one okay. proven court. Do you think uh, Joe Biden is going to help the black community like he says he's going to? He has in many ways. Okay. So uh, okay. I, I, got, I got no more. All right. Take care. All right. I just want to say, like, saying that people are, uh, like, accusing Joe Biden of being a P3O is, like, one of the most disturbed things. And I think anybody that says that has stuff on their computer.